Hi, I'm Paul, so thanks for tuning in. It's 10 a.m. on Friday, the 11th of August, 2023. So this is the camping e-trike part three video. So the e-trike still ain't come and it's in the delivery depot. It's been in there from Tuesday morning at 7 a.m. And yeah, it's Friday now. And yeah, I'm having no luck at all. So I messaged the eBay seller. They weren't very helpful at first, dismissed me. And then yeah, they realized after two days it will not moving. They must have started to panic and they've contacted the delivery firm. They said they've given them some grief and it'll be here in the next two to three days. But the next two to three days, well, it's Friday and it's gonna be a weekend. So it's not gonna be here till next week. Really disappointed. Two weeks ago, I bought a dog trailer. Like I said, I want to go camping with Flo, so I bought a dog trailer. It got to Yodel, the local delivery depot, and yeah, it was there for four days. Yodel decided to return it to the sender, and I just sacked it off and asked for a refund. So then with that money, I bought the sea trike, and the same happens. So yeah, I know it's a six week school holidays, and um, these delivery firms have a load of agencies staffing but yeah holding a parcel for three days is not good not when you've paid a fortune to get it delivered it's an e-trike i won't say how much it costs to be delivered but yeah it won't cheap so this video is going to be an unboxing when it finally comes and that's if it does come and it's going to be an unboxing i'll show you all my parts show you what i'm going to do and then we're going to start getting into the builds part of these videos instead of loads of vlogs just sat at my desk talking so as they always say let's do it can you see this am i seeing it right is it actually out for delivery um don't focus that well this gopro there's a the tracking history and it's out for delivery. No way. Will it come? I don't know. Will it? Will it? Let's see. <laughs> <coughs> so coughing, but yeah, just did that video of the screenshot and it come. It's already like this. Right, so it's sat there the 12th of August, 2023. It's quarter past 10 a.m. in my morning and look what's come. It come at eight o'clock. I've been doing a few things and yeah, I cut video straight away. So it's the e-trike, the electric tricycle. I opened a case last night. The eBay seller didn't like it and was really upset. <laughs> and yeah, give me a bit of grief. <laughs> but he promised that it'd come today and it did. So I've been on, I've closed the case and I'm gonna leave him positive feedback because he actually helped and got the item to me. Even though I really moaned about it and ranted about it, it's actually here. So he said, because it's an oversized parcel, it can take three days extra, which it has done. So yeah, I'm happy with that. So this is an unboxing of the Pashla Piccolo electric tricycle. Okay, so let's jump back on my tripod a bit and get a bit of a better angle so I can open it and you can see what's in it. Right, I've got my trusty box opening tool. Oh, that's a screw. <laughs> right, what we're looking at here. This envelope's a bit rips open already. I filmed my box before when it comes. Right, I'm gonna have to get the na no, I'll keep on catching my e bike and I'm not room. Right, box opening tool number two. So it's upside down. Come out of my box. So I'll get my bread knife and do some chopping. Oh, set my fingers. Don't want to chop my fingers. <laughs> Whoa! Right. I'm gonna get the camera off the tripod and show you what I've got. This happy little soul. She loves a good unboxing. So, it's upside down. 
not in the greatest condition as you can see by the paint work and all the rust but yeah that can be sorted out it's all the surface rust so e-bike wheel two back wheels it's all cable tied together so I'm going to cut the cable ties off put all the police the police I'm going to cut the cable ties off and pull it out of my box and yeah we'll have a better look so I'll catch up in 10 minutes okay right okay it's now half six so my niece has been up I've not seen her for a while so yeah we've had a good chat and I unboxed the bike before a lot earlier so I'm going to show you what I've got so a use power 36 volt 250 watt wheel it's disc brake compatible so that's a wheel seems okay this is a trike so the forks seem a bit stiff I don't know whether the bearings have gone but that's a threaded stem mat with a quill stem I've got a spare quill stem so I might fit another one but as you can see it's very rusty there's the handlebars got loads of surface rust all over it And I wondered why the seat posts didn't have supports on when all the other pastelists do. And it looks like they've been cut off there or they've broke off, as you can see. But that doesn't matter. So the frame in attached to the rear axle. That's a rear axle. So it's dirty, it's full of rust, but it was only cheap. There's the mud guards. The now, mud guard holders are probably all right, but the mud guards are knackered and um, they're ruined. So yeah, they're no good. So you said it's got BMX rims on it, but they are looking quite skinny for my 20 by 2.8 tires. So I'm hoping they fit. And there and there, big rollers. No the mess, it's chaos. But yeah, so that's a trike. It's not very big. It's not very ever and it's perfect so a lot of stress with the delivery like i said it went in my local depot at 7 a.m on tuesday and it come at 8 a.m on saturday um loads of stress loads of hassle not buying out online again done me heading proper done me heading i have no luck I always get the end of a stick but yeah that stick can be turned around to a golden handle can't it so <laughs> So yeah, I'm buzzing, I'm buzzing. So I'm not gonna put it together. I'm gonna clean it and I'm gonna start on my surface rust. I'm gonna have to spray out the frame and it needs quite a lot of parts. But yeah, it's pretty sweet. So you've been watching me, Paul. And where is she? What have you got? No wonder she won't come in. She's got a piece of cardboard. So Puppy Flow, you've been watching an unboxing of a Pashley Piccolo E-Trike. But it's not really an e-trike, it's just got an electric front wheel that wasn't originally on it. So I'm hoping this wheel works and we'll find out as we start putting it together. So consider subscribing, hit the bell for future future updates and don't forget to like, comment and share. And there's going to be more videos on this e-trike and I'm going to convert it for camping. Like I've said, I'm going to build a box on the back of it or somehow get flow on the back of it so yeah that's what i'll be doing so this naughty puppy says goodbye don't you hey come here